Hello everyone, this is Professor Patterns. And in this video, I'm gonna be showing you how you can find out what models you can run on your computer based on your current computer and system settings. So a lot of the times you might see a model like the DeepSeek R1 come out. And here you can see that there are all of these different levels, right? So there's a seven bill parameter one, a 32 bill, a 671 bill parameter model. And for all of these, there are different sizes as well. But what would be the right size for your system? In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can find that out. So first, if you're on a Windows, you will type in the keyboard shortcut Windows R, and that's going to open up Run. Here, you're going to type in DXDIAG, and I'm going to paste this in the description. So you type in DXDIAG, and then select OK. Once you do that, this is going to open up DirectX Diagnostic Tool. Here, you're going to select Save All Information. Now you want to save all of this information. Maybe it's something like your desktop. So I'm going to save it here and then I'm going to go over to my desktop. So now I'm going to open up the file and then simply copy everything. So control A and then control C. Then I'm going to go to Claude and here I'm going to paste all of those system configurations and settings. And the prompt is based on my system settings, what size LLMs from Olama can I comfortably run on my computer? So first it detects that I have an NVIDIA 4090 with 24 gigs of VRAM. I have a CPU and 32 gigs of RAM. And it says based on these configurations, I can comfortably run these models. So Mixtral, Llama, and any of these other models. Now, suppose that I want to run specific models like DeepSeek R1. I can go in here and I have all of these different settings, right? Suppose that I want to find out if I can run this one. So what I'll do is I'll say, can I run DeepSeek R1 32 bill with 20 gigs size? And we can see that this is the size, this is the 32 bill parameter model. So let's see if it tells us like if I can run this or not. So it says, yes, you can run this. Uh, with 24 gigs of VRAM, you'll have about four gigs of headroom. So it says I can run this model. What about this one? It's the 70 bill parameter model. So 70 bill with 43 gigs of VRAM. What about 70 bill with 43 gigs? So here it tells me that no, I can't run this model uh, because it's gonna exceed all of my VRAM by 19 gigs. And here is it giving me recommendations on what I can do if I wanted to run this. Now, what if I don't have a GPU anymore? Suppose I say, I don't have my GPU working anymore. What size models can I fit on my CPU? So here, let's see if it can give us some recommendations. And then I'm also going to select specific models like this one. So let's see if I can run the DeepSeek R1 7 bill parameter model on my CPU. So it says, based on the system specs, I have 32 gigs of um, RAM. And infer I can run most models, but inference speed is going to be lower. Um, can I run the 7 bill DeepSeek R1 model with 5 gigs of memory? So it's this one. It's 4.7, but I just run it up to 5. It says, yes, I can run this, but it's going to be much slower than running it on my GPU. But you can see that it does tell me what I can run and what I can't run. So this is how I would actually go and select what model I can run locally on my computer. Thank you all for watching. Hopefully this video was insightful and I'll see you in the next one.